Hello and welcome to another Castles video and today we're looking at this rather interesting property. Now it is probably not appropriate for those of you who are looking for a property to just move into straight away and put your things down and just enjoy. This is going to require some real work but let me tell you something, the position of this property, what it backs onto and the location are three reasons why you really need to come and have a little look. Here it is, I'm here on Kingsland Road in Boxmoor, let's go and have a look at this house. So join me through here into the property. We're literally just on the front door step now. This is the front door here. I just thought before we go in, we'd have a quick conversation about the access to the garage. Now, some people like to build up this area and put the front door right where I'm standing and then incorporate the garage and this back storage cupboard here into the main property. Current owners haven't done that for obvious reasons, you'll see inside, but that might be one way of actually expanding the overall space of the property. Now, let's have a little look inside, come with me. So here we are inside the property. You can see we've got a staircase leading up to the first floor and then doors off to uh, other rooms inside the property. We'll start in here, which is the kitchen. So if you come through with me right round here, you'll see you've got a nice sized kitchen at the front here, window overlooking the front garden of the property. Um, and just the general space in here is quite nice as well. Some people like to open this out into the room behind just to create one massive L-shaped kitchen dining room, which is lovely. And you'll see through here just how spectacular that would end up looking because this is quite a nice size room in here as well. Uh, you can see all the way around there. Obviously it's quite cluttered at the moment, but with a bit of vision you can see past that and you can actually see the potential here inside the property. Now behind me here you've got a storage cupboard. Uh, I think this is just the understair storage cupboard, which you can see in there. Lovely. So this is a nice little space in here, given the price for the property as well and what you can do to it. Um, this is actually a perfect property for first time buyers. Maybe you're a budding developer and you want to start on a small project. This would be ideal for you. So come with me upstairs and let's have a look at the first floor accommodation. So you join me on the first floor where we've got doors off to bedrooms one and two, a storage cupboard and then also the family bathroom. So we're going to have a look at the bathroom first, um, which is a rather, well, let's just put it this way, it's very pink and you can see that just by following me through here. Yes, there it is, the pink bathroom in all its glory. What a wonderful array. Obviously there's all sorts of interesting colours from eras of years gone by. Given the age of the property, it's not unusual to find this sort of decoration inside. Um, I think most people are gonna wanna rip all of this out and start again, which is fine. But uh, yeah, pink, that's a nice choice. <laughs> um, so let's have a little look in here, which is the second bedroom. And you can see it's a nice size room. Uh, again, you know, interesting wallpaper, nice use of colors in here, but obviously it's all things that you're gonna wanna rip out and start again with. But it's nice because you actually have quite a bit of storage in here, which if you can see just over my shoulder there, you've got this nice double width storage cupboard, which is excellent. Behind me here as well, you've got a large window just looking out over the road, uh, so you get plenty of light in here, which is wonderful. So onto the master bedroom, which is just through here, and you can see this is a great size. It runs the full width of the property, as you can see. Again, you've got a nice full length window on this side here and a big window over here as well. It's a really, really good size property, this one, and I think anybody who comes in here looking for a project is not gonna be disappointed with the potential. You've actually got a wonderful view of what this property backs onto, which is one of the main features. And you can see there a little hint, that canal boat and the canal running past along there. It's an absolutely picturesque location. People fall over themselves to try and get onto this street because especially on this side, on the south side of the road, you've got properties that just back onto that canal. And we all know how much everybody loves living by water. Um, so if that's you, then this could be a really ideal property. You've also got access to the loft as well. Now that's the upstairs space done. Let's go and have a look at the garden. So here we are in the garden, and I'm sorry to say that this is probably about as much as we're gonna be able to see, because as you can see from this, we are wall to wall with overgrowth. You can see what I mean, this really does need some work doing to it. 
Um, we can move forwards just slightly through here, try not to fall over anything or sting myself. So yes, from here you can see pretty much just green and trees everywhere. Um, I think this is just to illustrate the fact that obviously, you know, you've got a garden. Um, you've got a back fence there as well, which I'm not sure if you can see just over the top. But once this is all cleared out, you'll have an uninterrupted view of the canal, which is really what the appeal is here. Now let's go and have a look around the other side. So you join me right at the very back of the property, and just behind me here is the back boundary for the property. There is a fence panel in place and a walkway that runs down the back of the properties. You might be able to see just over my shoulder there, that is the garden from the rear. You may even be able to see the stinging nettles that I daren't pass. But the really interesting thing about this is just how beautiful the view is from here. You can see you're just literally right by the canal. You may even be able to hear the sound of rushing water from the nearby weir just behind there. And obviously all the land you see over my shoulder here all belongs to this development, the, uh, the river park development. So that means that there's no through traffic or anything like that. It's a very safe, nice area. And also you get to take advantage of those beautiful views. So if you think this is the kind of property for you, something that needs a bit of work doing to it, something that you're not afraid to rip apart, knock about and literally build back up uh, again internally from the ground up, then this would be ideal for you. Give me a call, Aaron, on Castle's number 01442 233345 or email me, Aaron at castlesboxmore.com. And until next time, I've been Aaron. Take care.